Welcome back guys to Pinoy Crossover to Boy Marky Mark. And here we're going to continue our sh show with highlighting more about Ray. But I'm going to throw it to JR to ask the question that we want to, you know, know more about the upcoming stuff that's, mm -hmm. you know, really in the basketball community. So JR, what do we have? So big things are happening uh, this summer. Uh, as you know, Clyde Passes was oh, here a few weeks ago, a few episodes ago. We talked about M Cup uh, tournament. But now we're in, they're introducing, you guys are introducing M Cup League. Ray is here to talk about it. Ray, what, what is... What is the M Cup League all about? So this is a brand new thing that's oh, happening. Yeah. Um, so let me just kind of rewind a little. Uh, so the M Cup League is stemmed from the M Cup tournament that's coming up. Mm -hmm. um, you know, with the M Cup tournament, it's always been just a regular Filipino tournament. It's mm -hmm. always been probably the biggest one we look forward to every summer. Mm -hmm. But it's just been Filipino tournament, you win, you get a medal. Mm -hmm. and you just go to the play. What we're, whole, what we're trying to do with the whole M Cup this year just making it like the best basketball experience mm -hmm. in Toronto. Um, and it's driven by the Filipino community, powered by PIDC. Um, but we're opening it up to other communities. Other than, yeah. With Toronto being so diverse yeah, um, for sure. and basketball growing so much in Toronto, mm -hmm. we figure, you know what, let's bring the other communities. Why, why not open it up to them? Mm -hmm. um, per, on a personal level, I felt growing up playing with Filipinos, it was great. But it didn't help me when I played against not I Filipinos, mean, you know yeah, what I mean? So yeah. why wait for them to get to college and stuff to do this and not expose them to playing with non-Filipinos um, right from, from, the, from the young age, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so the M Cup, that's, that's the, one of the big changes for the M Cup tournament. So the M Cup League is just kind of stemmed from it. Uh, we're just trying to raise more awareness for the tournament. Uh, right now, the M Cup League, uh, it's going to start April Third, mm -hmm. it's going to run every Tuesday nights at Patricia Camp, Dufferin and Center. Mm -hmm. um, the age division that we're focused on is Mosquito. That's the youngest division, yeah. uh, which is 2009 below or seven to nine roughly. Mm -hmm. um, so that's the division we're, we're focusing on right now, mm -hmm. uh, and we're just trying to, again, bring more awareness about the tournament and about the league. Because you know, in bigger picture, this league is not going to just be a Mosquito division. Mm -hmm. We want to get it in all divisions mm -hmm. and running throughout the year. Um, having that said, uh, we are starting with the youngest one because, again, that's the grassroots level. Exactly. And um, getting them exposed to the right kind of league and competition um, is great. So, difference. I mean, that's every Tuesday night, right? So, this right here. Mm -hmm. um, and then on the flip side, we also have on Monday nights, we, do, we have partnered with the Junior NBA. And oh, I'm wow. sure uh, Clyde ha has mentioned to you guys that they're also a partner with the M Cup tournament. Mm -hmm. So, with the Junior NBA, we're just going to run developmental program. For actually, uh, we said seven to nine, but we ha we've actually opened it up mm -hmm. to um, age four and above. Mm -hmm. uh, it's going to be ran every Monday night starting April 2nd, mm -hmm. um, and it is also going to be at Patricia Camp, mm -hmm. which is kind of be that's going to be Clyde and mine's home base um, yeah. for now in the Vaughn area. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm on the board as well for the M Cup yeah. tournament, but for the league, I'm actually the head chair for it. Okay. So again, we want to grow this to become one of the biggest leagues in Toronto. Mm -hmm. um, so devel developmental Junior NBA, we're excited to be partnered with. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, Junior NBA says, you know, speaks for itself. Exactly. It's the, it's, NBA is the biggest league in the world, it is. Uh, the best competition. And we're just trying to give the right tools for the, and we're starting even younger than a, our, our age, right? We're yeah. starting at five and below, yeah. or sorry, five four and, and above, mm -hmm. four and above. Yeah. Um, and just getting them the right coaching. Mm -hmm. um, the right exposure to basketball. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so we're really excited for that yeah. um, and can't wait for that to get started. In, in, in terms of, uh, I guess, uh, contacts for, for kids or for teams that want to uh, sign up for the, the league and for the junior NBA development program, how would they contact you guys? What would be the best way to... Yeah, so the best for both the developmental program and for the league, mm -hmm. uh, contact me directly. Mm -hmm. um, you, my number is... 416-832-6865. <laughs> but you also have, on the fly, you have my email address, which is risinggrindfitness at gmail.com. Awesome. And yeah, find your Instagram as well. And shout, Instagram, shout, yeah. Shout your Instagram. Yeah, yeah. Instagram, uh, just Ray Montagnel. R-A-Y-M-O-N-T-A-N-I-E-L. And then M Cup has their own. And M Cup um, Basketball also has their own um, Instagram as Instagram. well. So sure. message yeah. either one um, for any more information that anyone mm -hmm. has. That's great. And it's great that they are starting way, you know, the grassroots level and it's good mm -hmm. that you know kids are getting started with the right fundamentals yes. because that will build that will help them a lot once they grow and play you know at a higher level each and every year that yes, they grow for sure, right? for sure for sure and so. at, at the end of the day 
It's all about the kids. It, it is. is. It is. It's all about true. the kids. It is. It Especially is. for development leagues like this. Yeah. True. I mean, that's my driving passion. I mean, on my day to day, I'm a, I'm a personal mobile trainer, mm -hmm. uh, Rise and Grind Fitness, obviously. Um, but you know, basketball just doesn't stop calling me. It's true. So, which is why you know this year I'm really make it a point to give back to the sport, to the community that's given me literally everything I have. Mm -hmm. It's made me the person I am today, the husband I am today, the father mm -hmm. I am today, mm -hmm. and just the professional I am today with all the, the habits and, you know, the things you learn playing sport. Uh, in my, my case, playing basketball has just made me who I am, and it's time for me to give back. True. So, sure. Awesome, man. Yeah, man. So I'm excited. 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 I'm excited for the M League yeah. and the Junior Development League. I think it's great, too. Yeah. 